Hello, welcome to the Robotics for Kids tutorial. My name is Emerike Adeze. I'm a STEM education facilitator and I'll be your guide through this video. In this session, we'll be discussing about the planet Jupiter. Jupiter is the innermost gas giant. It is the fifth planet from the sun and the largest planet in our solar system. Jupiter was named after the supreme Roman god who was also known to be the king of other Roman gods. Its Greek equivalent is Zeus, but the Greek referred to this planet by the name Phaethon, meaning shining one or blazing star. Jupiter as the supreme god of the Roman pantheon was the god of thunder, lightning and storm, and he was called the god of light and sky. Here are some basic information about this planet. There are 79 known moons on Jupiter. Its distance from the sun on an average is 483.8 million miles. It takes 9 hours and 56 minutes for Jupiter to complete a rotation, that's a day, while it takes 11 years, 314 Earth days for Jupiter to complete a revolution. That is a very fast rotation and quite a slow revolution. Its temperature can get as low as minus 234 degrees Fahrenheit and of course it's a gas giant. Jupiter is the fourth brightest object in the sky after the Sun, Moon and Venus. It is one of the planets that can actually be observed with the naked eyes from Earth. It has been studied for so many years, dating as far back as the 7th century BC by the Babylonians. In 1610, Galileo Galilei, with the aid of his telescope, observed the planet closely and recorded some other discoveries, including the massive four moons of Jupiter, which he is famously known for. This was the first record of planetary bodies not revolving the Earth. And it was the first proof of Copernicus's theory that the Sun is the center of the solar system. Since the beginning of space exploration, astronomers have sent a number of spacecrafts and probes that orbit Jupiter to bring back data and detailed images. Jupiter as a gas giant lacks a true surface. That means there is nowhere someone can actually stand or an aircraft sent to Jupiter can land. As most of the planet is made up of gases, 89% of hydrogen, 10% of helium and it traces of other gases. The atmosphere on Jupiter is very violent with many storms raging on it. Its intense magnetic field is thought to be a contributing factor in protecting Earth from a bombardment of meteorites. As meteorites enter the solar system from the exterior area, they are caught up by Jupiter before they have a chance to get close to Earth. Now here are some fun facts about this planet. At number one, we'll be looking at the size. We know for sure that Jupiter is big. It is the largest planet in our solar system. But do we actually know how big it is? Now let me explain. Jupiter is 318 times more massive than Earth. If you combine all the planets in our solar system and fit into Jupiter, Jupiter will still be two times bigger than all of them. It will actually take 1,300 Earths to fuel Jupiter. Now that is very massive and intimidating. We are taking a look at atmosphere. Jupiter has the largest atmosphere in our solar system. The size alone allows that. The entire planet consists of mostly gas, hence the name gas giant. There is a part of the planet called the red spot that was discovered in 1665 by an Italian astronomer named Giovanni Cassini. This spot is larger than Earth and actually it is a hurricane that has been swelling for over 300 years. It is the largest hurricane known to be in our solar system. External features hold the number three spot. There are rings around Jupiter just like Saturn. These rings are in three major segments but they are way smaller and less noticeable than that of Saturn. Exactly 79 moons are found on Jupiter, including the four Galilean moons, Iowa, Europa, Ganymede, and Castillo. 
Ganymede is known to be the largest moon in our solar system. For fact number four, we have rotation and revolution. Jupiter's movement on its axis is the fastest of all planets in our solar system. It takes 9 hours and 56 minutes for it to complete a rotation a day. This makes Jupiter the fastest rotating planet in our solar system. While its rotation is at a very high speed, its revolution takes much longer, not just because of its speed, but also because of its distance from the sun. This has given rise to a larger orbit for Jupiter, so it takes approximately 11 years, 314 days for Jupiter to complete a revolution. And at the last spot, number five, we have the failed star. Jupiter is known as the failed star because of the similarities it shares with the sun, especially in composition. Scientists believe that if Jupiter was 75 times more massive than it currently is, it would have been a star. This mass is required so as for Jupiter to be able to cause its own fusion reaction, which is what gives rise to a star. Imagine if we had two suns in our solar system. <laughs> it would be really nice to wake up to one on one side and the other on, the, on another side. We'll be stopping here today. Do complete your crossword puzzle. Stay tuned and of course stay safe.